All right, guys, so let's learn the easiest way how to remember the boxing of the compass because it's sometimes it's an examination question also for some people. And you also need to remember this for a longer period of time. So here I'm going to show you that uh, how to remember this boxing of the compass. We have total 32 points in compass. Each covers 11.25 degrees. That is into 32, it is 360 degrees. So it has 32 points, 11.25 degrees for each of the point and 32 points is equal to the 360 degrees, okay? So let's draw a circle first. All right, it's a rough circle, so let's point north, south, east, and west first, okay? So the simple rule is here that you need to divide all this four section into half and further into halves, okay? So you have to divide each section into half. That is a simple rule we have to follow. So let's divide into half all of the sections, okay? Alright, so now we have 8 points here. So this you already know, very simple, northeast, this is southeast, southwest and northwest. Remember we have to divide this thing, we have to divide all of the parts again into half, okay. So we will divide this one, this one, this, this one, this one, this one, this one here and here. Well, this is a rough half, otherwise in examination you have to make it very, very clear that this is the half of the point. All right, so now the parts which we have divided, we have to name them also. So the naming procedure, it's very simple. So first we will put here north, north, east. Now how we name this one, it is between north and northeast, okay. But the prefix here will come the major cardinal point, okay. And the suffix means the letter which will come later on will be the northeast, okay. Now here this part is between east and northeast. So we will name it east, north, east. Remember you have to put east first because east is the bigger cardinal point here, okay. Here also the same, it is between east and southeast. So it will be east, south, east, okay. Very easy. And this is between southeast and south, but we will name it south southeast because we have to name the major cardinal point first all right now again you have to put between south to southwest that will be south south west very simple between southwest and west we will come west south west because west is the major cardinal point now here it is between west and northwest what it will be very simple west north west okay here it's very simple, it is between northwest and north, it will be north, northwest. Okay, now we have completed half of it. Let's start with further division. We have to divide all of the section into half now. Okay, later on it will come the by points. Now we will mention the by points. Okay, what are those? Let's start with them. So let's divide this from north to east, all the section into half. Okay, we have divided from north to northeast all the section into half. Alright, so now for the by points, you need to remember that you need to name this one, the second one and the second last. You need to name them first before doing anything else because they are the simplest one. So here you have to name here north by east, very simple, north by east and here from this one is east by north. Alright, it's very simple. It is near to the east, so we have to put east by north. This is near to the north, so we will put north by east. So the second and the second last, we need to name them first. Here the same procedure, if we go here, let's say this one and this one. This is the second last, this is the second one. What the name will be? This will be east by south and what it will be? It will be south by east because it is near to the south so we will put south first and east later on same goes for everywhere and we will do it later on so let's continue with this one here now we have to put the by name which is closer to the northeast now for the by points you need to remember that prefix can be northeast also so now here northeast is nearby here will be northeast by north because it is this side 
this is this side of the north so we will put northeast by north because obviously north is much nearer than east okay so we will name northeast by north now one point is remaining here what it will be it will be again northeast which is closer by east because it is closer to the east see how simple it is we have completed from north to east all right guys so now let's start with the section of from east to south we have marked the by points uh, of these two the second one and the second last let's start with the other by points okay now between east southeast and southeast we will divide this section also into two halves and this section also into two halves so uh, you already know how we going to name this one we will put southeast first because southeast is much closer by east because the east is much closer you can see this point is much closer to the east and south is much far away okay so we will put southeast by east and here we will put again southeast by but this time it will come south okay that's it we have finished second section also let's jump on to the next part here now we will divide again the second one and the second last we are going to name them first that is south by west here simple west by south okay i will just correct this one this okay now again we have to divide this section into half this section into half okay here we will put again southwest by this side south is closer south again southwest by this time west because this is more towards the west okay again we have finished the third part let's jump on this one one here and one at the second last this will easy west by north this one pretty simple north by west you already know how to do that let's divide the sections which are left this one is already done now this one okay and again this one you put north west first north west by this is closer to the west west and this will be north west by closer to the north north all right so now you can see here we have marked all the 32 points it is very very simple to remember this thing just remember the process which i told you here and you will never forget this thing okay i learned this method in my training time and it's been 10 years already and i still remember it just because this is the method i have learned if i am trying to mug it up all the points for sure you will forget it in about a week if you don't practice it again and again but you have to practice this method right about 4 to 5 times you just draw it in your paper in a rough paper and try to name all of them the uh, by the process which i told you here okay all right guys so that's it for this video if you find this video helpful please press the like button and also do subscribe my channel also share this videos to your friends also so that they can also learn this simple method to how to box the compass okay and very soon i'm going to come up with the videos which are related to the finance which are related to the personal finance actually uh, what i have done that in the last 3 uh, years i have read a lot of books on the finance and my finance before that was very terrible and now i'm right on the track and i just want to help you also guys the guys who are especially who are getting started with this field the money is going to come but the thing is people have lot of income in this field but they still are under lot of debt and they are terrible in managing their money so i am going to just give you the simple idea of how to manage your money so by th uh, so through that videos i am just going to explain you a simple things and i hope that video will help you in the future okay so i'll see you in the next video guys this is abhilash thakur signing off